Kate extended her trip to the Mediterranean, so you're gonna have to cover for me just like I covered for you all those times. Get your hands off of him! Mercedes! No, 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 I, I, I fear there's been a misunderstanding here. It is always the nanny. This is payback, isn't it, for everything that happened with Johnny? No, 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 I protest most strongly. You, this Why is would you hook up with Robin and Patrick's nanny, Spinelli? I thought you were above that. No retribution, hurtful or otherwise, was in play. You, you, you interrupted a, a platonic embrace of gratitude. Gratitude? For what? Um, the hotel maid who reported the mayor's deadly affair with Brianna Hughes was Mercedes' cousin, who is, alas, undocumented. Mr. Jackal has agreed to keep my cousin out of the investigation. He's even exploring her options for amnesty. Yes, I'm, I'm pleased to assist one less fortunate. <laughs> it's so great to see such a brilliant guy using his talents to help other people. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm honored by your praise, but I, I do have to stay on task, as it were. So. <laughs> Thanks so much. I, I, I'm, I'm, it's an honor to be of service. Bye. Hey, I know that was silly, and I trust you completely. Spinelli, I just... I would die if I thought you were going to be with anyone else. I'm really sorry that I got so upset about Mercedes. I don't want to seem like one of those women who's so insecure her boyfriend can't be around another girl. <laughs> boyfriend? Has a subtle but most profound shift taken place in Maximus's attitude? Hey, guys. Hey. The clock is ticking on the Brianna Hughes case. And Diane Miller filed papers in court. I'm sure that's really important, but we were kind of in the middle of something. Actually, no. Uh, the time has come for the jackal to prove that Brianna Hughes was indeed murdered. Do you have real evidence? Why? Well, I jackaled into the financial records of the doomed mistress and discovered a secret account. Apparently, the late Brianna Hughes was receiving money transfers mm -hmm. no. of over $100,000 from the mayor's private accounts over the last three months. Wow, so then what are we looking at, blackmail? Well, it is indeed a time-honored and most irrefutable motive for murder. Okay, so this, this makes sense. If Brianna and the mayor are having an affair, she blackmails him and then he kills her. I don't think so. I, he acted like he really cared about her. Remember he said he was planning on divorcing his wife? Oh, that could be all part of the subterfuge, as it were. Mm, I suppose. I don't know. I, I think we should just bring all of this to Uncle Mac. Indeed, and I will gladly contribute the corroborating evidence. Uh, wait. No, 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 Maxie, we can't wait. Every second costs me and my brother. What about what this is costing Spinelli? He just hacked into the banking records of a dead person and a public official. That's illegal. And if Mac finds out, he's going to report it to the FBI, and then Spinelli's going to be back in huge trouble. Yeah, once again, Maximista cuts to the heart of the matter. You guys were called to the scene the night it happened, right? Yeah, Olivia Falconeri called me to the Metro Court. Robin came because she was curious. Did you report it to the police? No, we agreed to be discreet. So you talked to the mayor? Yes. Well, did it sound like he was involved? His story seemed pretty shaky. And he took off before the ambulance got there. And Brianna Hughes was just passed out on the bed the whole time? The whole time. Robin, you know how this goes. Mac's probably going to believe you, but any other cop's going to think it's a cover story. Yeah, and if you two aren't careful, you could be named accessories to murder. <laughs> 